as we continue, the horse starts to, to fly. So they all fly in, starts to use his talents, going through. Lovely app. The, the artwork on this is just brilliant. I love it. Absolutely love it. Um, again, I'm going to show you the pictures from the book because the artwork is absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Look, there it is, said the horse. You found it, said the boy. So they so they just found something. It looks like a home, doesn't it, said the boy. Well, said the mole, here we are then. So they just found what looks like their home. Thank you, said the boy. So the boy's just saying thank you to the horse for flying them to finding their home. Goodbye. Always remember you're enough, just as you are, said the fox. Okay, just do that. And I think that's an important point. I'm going to just stop there because I think, again, it almost referenced that point to the horse and the wings. And I love that that reference to say you're just enough as you are. And sometimes I think we put a lot of pressure on ourselves to do other things that, you know, that, that maybe aren't us. Yes. Um, and that we try and do things that maybe we want, you know, we're doing it because of the pressure of outside or anything like that. So I think that's really important. I don't know what's happened there, but, <laughs> but I put out on my TikTok. But anyway, happy to, I don't know. But anyway, so that, that's a, I think that's a really important lesson. Um, what do you think? So that thing about always remember you're enough just as you are, said the fox. Anything I think that? there's a, and I don't know what it's called. I'm terrible at remembering stuff like this. It's taken me three weeks to remember the title of a book. So that's how bad I am. But there's a song I really, really like, and it's like an acoustic style song. And one of the lyrics in the chorus is, it's like you've been trying really hard and you're enough or it's enough. And it's a really good kind of that empowering type of song where it's just that really strong message. And I do I do think that that, I really like that as a message, you know, telling someone that what they do is enough or how they try enough or what they're doing. You're back, you've got your hat on TikTok again, Joe. I don't know, I don't what... know what's going on. I don't know what's <laughs> happening. I really don't. Sorry. So sorry, and I, I didn't articulate that very well, but that's I think I think it's a strong message. And it's a sort of that I don't do enough of that myself, I don't think. I'm always I had to do this today. So today I got a bit I was wavering near the end of the day and I did I was doing some stuff and I probably could have done better with it. But like yesterday and the day before I had blistering days and I saw something and it's it's like what you know it's a graph and it goes up and down up and down up and down but at each peak it says your best your best your best and underneath it says um that it's you know your best isn't the same every day and you know for some days that's excelling and building an empire and for other it's just dragging yourself out of bed because you feel terrible and I remind myself of that sometimes you know there's all sorts of reasons why one day you're up here one day you're here but as long as you're trying your best that can that can peak and trough and I think that's the same as that it's enough or you're enough message and I think more people need to believe in that in themselves yeah I agree with you there and I uh, say like the everyday thing and it's actually a very stoic thing you're saying there it's very stoic because and i know i sent a stoic thing in the chat as well Darren brown and stephen bartlett i think and yeah and i haven't watched bucket... that what's that <laughs> sorry, sorry thank you jc ruby said he bucket hat so that's how i was wrapping someone said to me gifts so they're actually appearing on my head it's brilliant <laughs> thank you jc ruby for the gifts appreciate it gift the badge or something so yeah brilliant that's what's happening anyway so yeah so that's what it is and i've not watched that so, yeah. brown yet but i think stoicism is yeah. going to be a big thing for us this year and it is I just you fall into that comparison culture. It's like, oh well, all these people are doing better than me, or why do these people do and and all of that without there's no matter what you do, you're always and everyone does it at every level. Everyone compares themselves to someone else for something else. And I just think the more people can look inwards rather than outwards, the the happier you be, which comes back to kind of like the stoicism thing you're saying. It's saying I'm trying to work on as well, but it's a it's a really strong message. I think um, you're really good at that. I think you are really good at that. Uh, the going inside because I think you you know you're, you're naturally a bit introverted and I think you I've had to learn that a lot I have but know? I think I've had to challenge last few years I've had to really push myself and challenge myself on it and I try and pass it on to people but it's always with that message that I didn't always do that and I know how I feel better now and I slip I don't do it all the time but you just need to keep practicing and practicing 